you do pureed apple and pear. Okay, first of all, we need to prepare the fruit. So we're going to chop the end of the pear and then peel. Bottom off. Okay, and then the same with the other one. Okay. And I'll chop it into fairly small pieces. into a saucepan. Okay, and now we're going to do an apple as well. One apple and one pear should make enough for about four or five portions. size chunks again. Okay. Okay, so we're removing all the skin and all of the pips. Okay. I won't do that other one for now, but you can uh, get the impression here. Okay, so we've got um, some fruit now and we're just gonna add a little bit of water. We don't want to add too much we don't want all the nutrients to be lost in the water. Okay, this can either be boiled in the saucepan or you could um, steam it over in a bowl over the saucepan. Okay, we're just gonna cook it now. Over to my cooker. Okay. So then this will take about five or 10 minutes, just till the fruit's softened. There we are, it's ready. Okay. So what you need to do now is put this into the right consistency for your baby. So you could use the sieve method. So once this fruit's nice and soft, you pop it into the sieve, then you mush that through and pass it through the sieve. You'll get a nice sort of first food consistent, like a very nice puree. Or you could add it into a jug and, and blend, and that would make a nice smooth consistency as well. And that's how you have apple and pear puree.